If you are a French speaker, you can turn on the subtitle so you can follow this tutorial. Si tu parles français, tu peux activer les sous-titres, comme ça tu pourras suivre ce tutoriel. Merci Hello guys and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to make a miniature frame. Here is a frame that we will make. For this tutorial, you won't need an embroidery machine, so it's great! We are going to make everything by hand, so let's go! And I hope you enjoy! First, we will start by making the frame. Take a screenshot of the resin recipe so you don't lose it. Add some white resin dye if, like me, you want to paint it later on. I use some gold acrylic paint from the brand Green Stuff World. As I said in my Van Gogh video, I really love this brand. They are quite expensive but really worth it. You can add a second coat to make sure that it has a nice opacity. For the embroidery, I will use some regular fabric. Then I will draw a rectangle to make sure that I draw in the right place. For this tutorial, you will need some regular and basic sewing thread and needles. No need for embroidery thread. I made my drawing with a pink band because I didn't want it to fade away while I was sewing. Now I will leave you with a little time lapse so you can see how I proceed. As with my regular embroidery, personally I like to start by the outline. Then I will fill the embroidery. I really liked making this miniature embroidery, so I will definitely make a lot more video like this. Once you are done, spread some varnish glue to the back of your piece. Do this two to three times to make sure the fabric doesn't fall apart after cutting it. Once it's dry, you can frame your embroidery. Now you need to have some plastic sheet. You can buy them from the internet or you can find them on some old packaging. Be 
Between each coat of glue, you need to wait until it's dry, or your piece will move or worst, it will completely fall apart. You can hide the ugly side of your frame with some fancy paper. And then you are done! And that's it for today. We hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, consider subscribing to our channel. You can also click on the bell button so you can have a notification every time I upload something. You can also follow us on our social media, so you can tag us on our, your photo, so I can see your creation. You can tell me in the comment down below which frame is your favorite, because I already made two other frames on this channel, and that's it! <laughs> Thank you so so much for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Goodbye! Let's go.